Hi guys, I'm back. I'm so glad to have my uh, webcam back. You just don't even know. So today I want to talk with you about um, just again planning and organizing your day. It's easy to, to get away from doing that. Uh, just because you have so much going on in your mind about what you have to do, you run that laundry list down. But the danger in that is you don't maximize your day. So I want to talk with you real quick about maximizing your day and just give you a little tip of something that I'm doing lately. And um, hopefully it'll help you. If it doesn't, then hey, try something different. But at least try and do something towards organizing your day, managing your time so that you can get the most out of your time. So what I've been doing is, in addition to trying to get better about working in my planner, is I am actually timing myself. Yes. So what I do in organizing my day, I have been writing down how long I am going to take to do a particular thing. So if I say I am going to spend no more than an hour on writing, say whether it's a book, an article, several articles whatever it is it's one hour of writing i set the timer on my phone um which i mean everybody everybody's phone has a timer if you have an alarm clock it's got a timer I promise you i set the timer for one hour and at the end of the hour when the timer goes off a little buzz whatever it is goes off i stop i don't care where i am in the writing process I stop I, I, I have to um, sometimes I'm done before the hour is up, and that's a good thing so now I can check off I can save I can do whatever I'm gonna do and that's an extra you know whatever if it's an extra 10 minutes then that's an extra 10 minutes and I leave that 10 minutes open so that I'm flexible to do something else so then I go on to the next thing that I'm going to do if I'm going to spend no more than an hour checking emails and responding to emails I'm going to do the same thing um, whether you know if it's social media I'm doing 30 minutes on social media then it's 30 minutes of social media so this way I'm really capitalizing on the hours in the day that I have and then I can really see where I'm wasting or squandering a lot of my time doing things that I um, that are not productive um, when you what basically what I'm doing I'm, I'm kind of a, doing something like what Dave Ramsey says you do with your money you assign your money to something so I'm assigning time because to me time is money and for a lot of people time is money I'm assigning time to certain tasks there's nothing wrong with that and again you can see when you do that you can see where you're squandering your time and if time is money how much of your time how much your time is worth how much of that you are wasting on um, things that are not productive and so when you do that you'll get to see that you won't have as much of a laundry list of things to do anymore but you're checking them off and you're getting them through and you're able to do the things you need to do now if you are a procrastinator and you're really bad about time management this is going to help you i really believe that it will because it's going to force you to become more disciplined with your time and um, it forces you to sit down and do the things and address the things that you need to address and it helps you see how much of your time you're wasting on other stuff when you can be more productive with um, some things in your life so if there are some things that you really want to do like hey i want to get more reading in um okay i tell you what then schedule time to read and don't allow yourself to kind of sway from that it's easy to say hey i'm gonna go to dinner with my friends instead of reading oh okay okay but then you're disappointed at the end of the month when you haven't read anything so um and that's okay so whether okay i'm going to read for 30 minutes 30 minutes a day i'm going to read i don't i don't care if it's a magazine a book something i'm going to read but i'm going to read 30 minutes a day so just kind of um wanted to share that with you give you a little tip of what i'm doing so far so good and i'm going to keep up with it and hopefully it'll help me be more organized and get more done in a day um sometimes you have so much going on in your mind it's kind of hard to figure out when to tackle and attract uh attack the love when to tackle those things um because you're overwhelmed by it and then you just sit there like i don't really know what i'm supposed to be doing right now 
that's because you've got so much in your mind that you've got to get it down and start checking it off uh, or you know you're just going to keep adding to the things that you have to do and then when you have a long list of things to do it's not encouraging it does not make you want to do it if anything it makes you want to run in the opposite direction and not do it so this is a way to be able to um take care of some things on your to-do list do some things that you really need to do <coughs> and um and accomplish and then you'll see kind of your own progress as time goes by so hopefully that i help you um you know let me know leave me a comment on how this has helped you if it hasn't then okay try something different but this is something i'm doing and so far so good so um yeah so we'll talk about it and talk about it in the comments let me know what your thoughts are and yeah until next time this is the classified lady signing off i'm sending you lots of love and light until next time have a fantastic day bye